Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode here in the lovely world of raccoons with me, Vanilla Raccoon. Hey yo! Check it out, you guys. We got ourselves a new skin, and it is thanks to the one, the only Squishy, aka Squash. Yes, Squishy. Well, I mean, Squash was ever so kind to make me the skin, and originally it was in the Steve format, but I uh, he was able to quickly turn it into the Alex skin format. And dude, Squash, if you're watching this. Thank you ever so much for it. But anywho, you guys, um, in this episode of Vanilla's Log, we're actually sort of going to be showcasing something we did in stream from last night. Today, as I record this, it is Christmas Day, and it is a beautiful 72 degrees outside. Mm -mm -mm. Um, but then we're also going to begin to, off camera, get some work done on something very special and monumental because earlier today, I had unfortunately learned by watching... False Symmetry's gameplay of Minecraft Story Mode Episode 4. Spoiler alert for Episode 4 in the event you haven't played or watched it yet. Ruben, our dearly beloved pig Ruben, dies. I cried. I really did. Uh, but anywho, yeah, so in this episode off camera, we're actually going to be building a monument for Ruben here in the lovely world of raccoons. So, <coughs> the very first thing that I would like to actually showcase to you guys <clears throat> is in the event that you missed last night's live stream on Christmas Eve 2015, uh, we basically built this medieval themed bridge and it is dedicated to Squishy, aka Squash. Um, uh, there we go. I had to quickly gain my thought because I was suddenly having a blank. Uh, I was having a brain fart, that's what it's called, and also trying to get out of the water. But yes, so we built him this bridge, and it's going to be dedicated, to, well, it is dedicated to him. Apparently, I'm going to start sneezing off camera. Um, but then, what we started to do was we made a little pathway, so when you spawn into this world, you can spawn in over there. Well, you will spawn in over there. You can go ahead and cross this nice, cool-looking little bridge. That sounded like a train whistle. And then from here, you have the option of going up the staircase. Or back right in here is where we're going to have our monument to our dearly beloved pig, Ruben. Rip. rip a -rooney. And so, yeah. But in the event that you go straight into the world of raccoons after crossing the bridge, you're then going to come up to here, which is what we also built on camera. And when you first come out into the world... Da 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 da! You can see our castle. Uh oh! Oh no! We got hit! We got hit! I took an arrow to the hip, of all places. An arrow to the hip. Hey, get out of here! Move! Move! Get! Jeez, I'm trying to record. Do okay, you know what? No. So then, like I was saying, you can then take shelter into our little humble home. Hey, Phoenix! It's okay, Phoenix. I got this. See, Fiend? It's okay, Phoenix. I got you. I'll let you play outside for a little bit, okay? <coughs> In any event that it is nighttime when you join the world, or you do so much wandering around that it then becomes nighttime, you'll then be able to just come in here, and because at this point, it's not really lit too well, but don't worry. By the time the next world download goes up for you guys, it'll be fairly well lit. Trust me. And you'll be able to just quickly run into here, go sleepies, and then, uh, yeah. Oh, somebody went poof. Who went poof? Shadaisy! So, that's pretty much what I wanted to start off this episode showing you guys is the medieval themed bridge that is dedicated to Squish Eye, aka Squash. And then the little entrance, um, the one thing I want to just point out is the reason why this does not have a roof or any other walls exceeding one block in height from the floor here is because I try to really envision this having a dome roof as opposed to like a castle roof like that. Castle, medieval castle tower roof such as that. Um, I just couldn't picture it. And instead of trying to exhaust my creative juices at the time i just said we're gonna leave it as it is and i put my signature on it and bam so you guys let me go ahead and get started off camera working on the monument for ruben 
our dearly beloved pig from Minecraft Story Mode. Spoiler alert, cough cough. <laughs> and then I'll come back to you guys when we have something to look at and mourn and pay our respects to. So, hey, why you open door when I'm trying to talk? Making noises in the background? Jeez, Mr. Testificate. Anywho, you guys. <clears throat> so I know I said we'll come back when we have uh, the monument already established or at least you know when we're working on it off well to show you guys what i did off camera um this is what i did off camera uh this right here i decided let's go ahead and make a three by three um pathway and what i mean by three by three is we're gonna go three three and then another three three um excuse me for that and what i pretty much did here was i placed Dirt blocks that are now thankfully turning into grass blocks, but we have grass blocks, uh, coarse dirt, gravel, and our good old cobblestone half slabs. Um, oh wait, why is there nothing there? Uh oh. <coughs> there we go. Um, I at least think this looks like an okay-ish looking pathway. I'm not the best at making pathways, especially in a medieval themed, but you know, like what I say, practice makes perfect. And off camera, I'm definitely going to be, you know, working on this. Step up my pathway game, I guess. Um, the reason why we have an open block space right here is because I wanted to give this ground that broken up, worn out type of feel. Because medieval pathways or roads, whatever they were properly called back then, um, they don't, I don't think that they were well kept or well neat. Especially out in the peasant area of the medieval castle kingdoms, whatever. Again, peeps, terminology is not my best suit, so please pardon me. And if you happen to know the right word that I should be using, feel free to let me know in the comment section. Be like, hey, yo, vanilla, what you meant to say was blah, 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 not da, 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 da. But anywho, you guys, yeah, I kind of just wanted to come back real quick and show you guys what it is that we have going on so far. Um, if, not on, if not off camera, then during tonight's live stream, I will then... Uh, bring up this pathway so it meets up to our little entrance to the kingdom right here and yeah because again every 20 episodes for our let's play series here in the lovely world of raccoons a world download will be going out and i think for the next world download i would like to focus on getting the actual housing residential uh f blacksmith forge tavern structures up and going and then also at the same time in the background work on our castle and everything. Um, because the first run, world download was mainly just working on the castle right here. And I think I want to break it up into different sections, whatever, updates, whatever you want to call it. But enough ranting and such. Let's go ahead and continue to work off camera and I'll see you guys in a moment. I'm just chopping up the pumpkins and the melons with an iron axe in the lovely game of Minecraft. Oh, hey, Phoenix. How you doing? Oh, you want to go see... <coughs> I'm dying on camera again. Um, You want to go see the monument for Ruben from Minecraft Story Mode? Okay, Phoenix. Come on. Let's go see the monument that we have made for Ruben. So, anywho, you guys. Yeah, this is pretty much what it's going to be. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. Let me just go ahead and get up here. Jeez, Vanilla. That's it? That's what all the hype is about for this monument for the pig, Reuben? Uh, no. No, 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 no. This is just, um, well, actually, I still gotta work. Oops. I still gotta work on this part, but I'm gonna do that off camera. Uh, come on, Phoenix. Or you can just go ahead and do your own thing. This is our monument for Reuben, dearly beloved pig. Um. <coughs> that is the coffin. Hey, Phoenix. Come on. Set. Good girl. This is going to be the coffin for Reuben. Over here, we're going to have just some memorial stuff for when people come to pay their respects. You know how people bring flowers. You can just go ahead and leave a flower inside of here and then some extra storage for whatever. We got little bookshelves because right back here, we're going to have actually an enchanted table and also... We're going to have some more bookshelves, but I need to gather up some diamonds and leather so I can finish this up. Hence why we have a random stone block here. But also right here, we do have some furnaces to act as a crematory. So that way, 
Um, if anything else in the lovely world of raccoons were to unfortunately pass away, then we could just go ahead, bring their remains here, and turn them into ashes, and yeah. I know, Phoenix. We gotta pay our respects. Okay, so unfortunately, you guys, that is all the time that I do have for today. I do hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you... I hope I didn't spoil Minecraft Story Mode Episode 4 for you, but in the event that I did, I'm sorry. <coughs> so, <coughs> am I done dying on camera? Yeah, I think I'm done dying on camera. Okay, so, if you like what you see, then please give that like button a hug and subscribe for the latest buzz. And if you had a blast, let the good laugh. Then make sure you favorite this video and share with a friend or two. But until next time, peeps, this is Vanilla Raccoon. Peace out.